Welcome back to Weg's Garage. Today on our 1964 Triumph TR4, we're going to be fixing a little problem we created when we put our alternator and narrow belt conversion on this car. And that is that the narrow belt conversion kind of removes the factory timing mark from the flywheel. That timing mark is critical for getting this car timed perfectly. So we need to figure out a way to uh, get that back on there. So today we're going to be showing you how to find top dead center on this car and mark it on the flywheel. Stay tuned. get the uh, number one cylinder spark plug uh, removed uh, because that's the one that when we talk about top dead center that's the one we're trying to get lined up uh, at top dead center with our mark so uh, to do that you take that out and then we need to put in a piston stop which dad's got right here allows you to kind of adjust the length so it will work on a bunch of different cars so all right so with our piston stop installed. Uh, now we basically have to rotate the uh, crank using the bolt on the end of the flywheel. Uh, basically rotate it all the way one direction until it hits the stop, make a mark, rotate all the way the other direction, make another mark, uh, and then between those two marks is going to be top dead center. If we look down here you'll see there's a little pointer and that's what we want our mark to point to. Uh, our car, for some reason, didn't have a pointer here. I think it must have broken off or something, so we actually made one. Cut to a little clip of us putting that on there. We stuck it on there using some 3M high temp VHB tape, so it uh, should be good. We didn't have to weld or anything, which is nice. Um, so now we just got to get our marks on there so we know where top dead center is.
All right, so we got our two marks on. We turned it back and forth, and we put a mark right in the center. Uh, we also shined a light right inside the piston hole and kind of observed, and our center mark there looks like it's right on. All right, so that's uh, pretty much all there is to it. Uh, we also took a drill bit and just kind of made that hole more of like a little dimple on there uh, just so we wouldn't lose it in the future. I will say if you're doing this conversion with the narrow belt from moss and all that, uh, definitely take the time to find top dead center before you put everything else back on. Uh, we were kind of new at this, so we didn't really know, but uh, it would have been a lot easier to get at and everything. Uh, but it's not impossible once it's on. All right, so that's finding top dead center. Uh, that's all we got time for this time. If you like this video, go ahead and hit that like button. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already. We'll see you next time.